Hey, this is Alivia. Welcome and thank you for coming back to my channel for another video. And in this video, I'm just going to show you a few things that I got for my birthday. Um, some things I got for myself and some things my baby got me. Hey. Anyway, so the first thing I'm going to show you and it is um, actually a printer. I had been saying that I wanted a printer. Um, I wanted a wireless printer because the printer that I have or that I have, have had the printer that I've had is like probably over 10 years old and yes it still prints and no I'm not going to get rid of it unless I find somebody that you know needs a printer and they're like okay they're fine with getting it but I needed something that was you know wireless that didn't tie me to sitting right by the printer um, because I work downstairs sometimes and sometimes I work in here sometimes I work in my bedroom and when I printed I needed to have that freedom to be wherever I was and then come to the printer and get what I I needed to get and so babe surprised me with a new printer and it is let me see it's right here it is the HP Envy Photo 7155 and let me show you some of the pictures I printed Well, actually um, I'm gonna show you two because two of them are with me and babe and uh, you know I'm not ready to put that out there in the universe to the world but anyway <laughs> anyway so this picture right here um is a picture that i took with my phone on my birthday before you we went out so i don't know if it's getting washed out but you know that's what the picture looks like and then um i printed off this picture of pumpkin eh print out this picture of pumpkin yes my baby is 16 years old now so she's growing up but this is a picture that I printed of her and I took this picture with my phone so I print wirelessly from my phone from my MacBook as well as from my work computer um, when I have it at home and the good thing about being able to print from that one as well as the fact that with my other printer for some reason I couldn't print from my MacBook which made it inconvenient for me to do things for my MacBook so now I'm so glad that I have a device that I could print from any one of my um, devices with so yeah so I have that printer um, and of course I was uh, able to go to the concert and all that kind of good jazz and you know um, just having the printer was enough but you know fate looks out for me in more than one way. Let me show you some of the things that I got for myself for my birthday. Um, you know I do have a friend that you know says she would take me out for um, dinner for my birthday so you know it's not like a big deal for me I mean I'm just grateful to be older and men and if someone acknowledges my birthday that is fine and dandy with me but I'm not looking for people to do things for, me for my birthday I mean I'm no longer a teenager I'm no longer in my early 20s where I feel like my birthday has to be acknowledged and I have to get something um, but getting something is just that extra perk and I'm never gonna turn anything down I'll put it that way so with that being said I I did buy myself some things and I could just straight up kick myself. All right, so Too Faced had the 30% off. It was 25% off for everybody else. And then I guess some of us got a cold or what have you. Maybe people that have previously ordered from Too Faced or whatever. And we were able to get 30% off with the friends and family. And so I did get a couple of items and I didn't want my purchase to go over a certain amount. So that may be why I didn't go ahead and just buy another foundation. But I really, really should have went ahead and got me another foundation in the Butter Pecan. The good thing about it is I do have the brulee. So until my tan is 100% gone or until the sun is 100% gone most of the time, you know, I'll just use a different foundation. But I'm telling y'all, this Too Faced Born This Way is one that I am truly, truly loving. So with that being said, though, I did get me another concealer and I got this one in the Warm Sand, which is the one that I've already been using. So... Um, this is my warm sand I have that I've been using and it's not to the point to where it's empty but baby when I tell you 30% off you cannot beat that with a stick now I do understand you know they have Sephora will have their 20% coming up as a matter of fact I think Ulta has 20% going on right now and 20% is fine and dandy but 30% is 10% more than 20% so you do the math okay and so I also did get um, one of the concealers and I got this one in the color mahogany and the reason why I got this one is is because I want to use this one for a contour now you all know right now I do have the Fenty that I'm using to contour with but I did want to use this so I have just two options so let me show you what it swatches like on my skin because I haven't swatched it so it's of course darker than my skin so this should be really really good for a contour for me 
so that you can see that but yeah so I wanted to give this as another contouring option and so y'all know if you've been on my channel for a while you know I'm one of those people that wants free shipping so if I can spend a few extra dollars to get free shipping ship free ship shipping uh, if I can spend a few extra dollars to get free shipping that is what I'm going to do and they had the born this way sample translucent powder it's the ethereal setting powder and you all know I'm a Laura Mercier girl from through thick and thin. I'll put it that way. I love Miss Laura Mercier. Um, Mercier, Mercier, however you want to pronounce it. But I did want to go ahead and try this. And it is, um, it just says translucent. And I haven't opened it yet, but it has like a little, the little um, tape to peel back. And then it has like, it looks like you can kind of open this. I don't want to open it up, but yeah, the sifter thing on the top, it looks like you can take the sifter off, which is a good deal without having to you know pry it open because that's what I do have to try to do with the Laura Mercier is try to pry the and I, I just finally give up I just tap 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 till I get all of it out all right so that is what I got from Too Faced and like I said I really 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 could kick myself for not going ahead and get another concealer in the Butter Pecan because while the Butter Pecan is darker now I can um work with the concealer I mean not the concealer the foundation to make it work Y'all, I don't know why I'm messing with this hair. I have not, I have not flat ironed it in over a week. I may flat iron it, flat iron it this week. I've had it in for two weeks and I'm still loving it. Uh, I think this is going to be my due for the summer. I'm not even going to summer. For the winter, I'm not even going to lie. I do plan on flat ironing my hair at some point, but not right now. Um, So, yeah. You'll see that coming. All right, so from Sephora, I did get a couple of things for myself from Sephora. And that's because they had the 20% off. Or did they? What did they have? They had a 20% off. I don't know what I got. I got something. But anyway, I ended up getting the... No, I had a gift card. That's what it was. I had a gift card. And so I ended up getting the Fenty Beauty, the um, one of the new liquid lipsticks by Rihanna. And this one is in the color Unveil, which is what I have on now. And I'm still trying to kind of get used to the color. It's such a chocolatey brown. And looking at myself now <laughs> in the camera, it's like, girl, you're popping. That stuff is popping on you. But sometimes I just think, I wonder if it's too dark. But this is what it looks like in the tube. And even though I have it on, I will kind of watch it and for those of you that have not seen the um these lipsticks this is what it the applicator looks like um i almost lost my words but that's what the applicator looks like and here it is swatched on my hand i do want to try one of the other colors and I do think that when Sephora has their 20%, their VIB 20% off sale, I may go ahead and give it a try then to see if I do like one of the other colors that's a little bit lighter. But I decided to start with this one because this one is kind of like, to me, one of those vampy type colors. Okay, and so the next thing that I did get from Sephora what is this Becca Lip Tuitive Glow Gloss. This is what the packaging looks like and... I don't know. Um, I bought this pretty much because it was on sale for $12.50 and I was trying to finish out the gift card. But I don't know if I like this. Let me tell you why. Because it is supposed to be, um, and it says lip intuitive. Take off lip and make it intuitive. But anyway, it's supposed to, um, it's kind of like a mood lipstick. It, 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 and it just, the pink that it's supposed to become is what matches or, or is supposed, supposed to become the perfect pink for your body. Um, however, when I put this on, I waited a few minutes and I waited a few minutes and I waited a few minutes and I waited a few more minutes and then a few more minutes and I didn't see a change. It was just like it was still clear. I'm actually going to keep it. I'm not going to send it back because, you know, it's a gloss and it's moisturizing, but... You know, um, maybe it could have been my mood or whatever was going on with me when I put it on this morning because that was supposed to be what I wore today, but I ended up putting this back on, putting this on today. But yeah, um, it kind of just doesn't, I don't know if it does, it doesn't, so far it hasn't done what it says. All right, and so I also was able to get, a, um, I guess you could say a deluxe sample from them, and this is Barack Baroque Dr. Robux. Yeah, okay. This is a Dr. Robux 2-in-1 mask and scrub. And I don't know if you can see that, but it's a deluxe size sample. And they don't usually give deluxe size samples. But I got this. I'm really, really, really trying to... Um, 
up my skincare game and do my mask and all that kind of stuff a little bit more often than what I have been doing to make sure I take care of my skin and like right now I do have um not breakouts but I got a I don't know whether you can see it. I got a little friend over here. You know, sometimes it just happens that way and my face is broken out just a little bit. Alright, and then the next thing I have, I actually didn't purchase this. I went on to BoxyCharm site and I used some of my charm points to get this Dr. Brandt primer free. And I don't know if you all get BoxyCharm, but BoxyCharm is a subscription-based um, subscription based company and you get makeup products full-size makeup products sometimes five to six well usually five products but sometimes you end up getting six it just depends and you earn these points to get things and i've had points and i haven't used them and in one of the box they boxes they sent out this you can see i mean i've used it i've murdered this i've murdered this but it's pores no more luminizing primer and i have used it up and so before it ran completely out because i think i have just a little bit more in there that i can get out or at least I'm going to make sure I get it out. But, you know, I may may even take some scissors and cut this bad baby just to get the rest. Because this stuff is really, really good. So, anyway, I went on there and I got this. And I think this retails for like $38 or something. But I didn't have to pay for it because I used some of my charm points to get it. So, yes. I have this. And there is something else that I did order for myself for my birthday. But it has not come in yet. And I don't like it when I order from companies. And it takes a long time for things to come in. But, anyway. any rate. You know, I have to work with them, work with the company sometimes because you never know. And and during the time when I ordered from this company, they had buy one, get one free sale going on. So I just would like to get an update at least to know what's going on with the products that I did purchase. That is it for this video. Thank you so much for coming back to watch another one of my videos. I really do appreciate you taking the time out of your busy schedule to watch one of my little bitty videos. So before this video ends, though, go ahead and subscribe if you're new to my channel. And if you're not new to my channel or if you're new to my channel, go ahead and like this video. Video, leave me a comment and share this video across all your social media sites and with that being said yeah what am I going where am I going next oh yeah until the next time and in between time you ladies and gentlemen be safe and I will do what see you in the next one bye